to get you here quickly. You should start from here and let us take care of everything in between. Flextronics SBS, innovative manufacturing services. Hello, I'm Philip Stoughton. I'm here at Electronica 2012 and I'm joined by Mark Goodwin from Ventec Europe. Mark, Hi, Phil. thanks very much for coming to talk to me. It's all right. it's all right. um, you have an announcement regarding a particular award of a um, approval. Yes, we, about that. yes, we've just in our um, uh, Suzhou facility in China been um, audited against AS uh, 9100C okay. and um, passed with flying colours and recommended for accreditation, which means mm. another few weeks the formal accreditation happens. So we have AS 9100C, the aerospace um, uh, approval, which okay. is uh, really great news, I think. Okay, uh, and are you are you going to be one of many with that, or are you the? F are you I the believe we're the first laminator okay. to have this. So we were the new kids on the block, <coughs> and I think now we're setting the standards. So yeah. uh, oh, that's pretty exciting, yeah, isn't it? To be, yeah. to be leading the market, and that'll shake yeah. up a few of the, um, yeah. the bigger competitors and make them sit up and take notice. And what does that mean to you in terms of projects that you've got access to? Well, we've we've been developing a business in the military and aerospace um, uh, sector for some time. We have a lot of products that fit that sector, mm -hmm. um, but this is a, a a, a very difficult sector to mm. enter. Uh, it takes a long time, a lot of customer approvals, OEM approvals, uh, and we just feel that this will get us more on the radar and yeah. allow that um, good progress we've made to snowball a little bit now. Yeah. Because you know, here we are saying we're in this business, yeah. we're committed to this business, yeah. and we're investing to uh, yeah, demonstrate invested. our capability. Yeah, absolutely. That's, yeah. that's really important. And it seems to me that the harder a, a sector or a customer is to get into, the longer you tend to keep that customer and the and the, the more of a partnership you can build with that customer. Is that true in this sector? It, it is. Um, you know, a lot of people who know me in this industry know I'm not a patient guy, but in this business <laughs> you have to be patient. Okay. Uh, but once you're in, yeah, you, you know, you have to you, you have to screw up badly to yeah. be out. Uh, but you know, you have to put a lot of investment into control yeah. what you're doing. Yeah to maintain uh, and reap the benefits of that upfront investment yeah. of, uh, uh, of accreditation and approval. It takes okay. time. And the facility's there in China, but you're going to be selling that product worldwide, I guess. Yes, worldwide. We have facilities in the, U uh, in the US, dis distribution and service centers in the US, and the same in Europe, uh, and obviously in Asia. And we plan to expand the AS9100C accreditation to our distribution business. Firstly, the UK company, which is right. our service center for polyamide, our real yeah. uh, high-end product for this yeah. market. Uh, and that should be in place by the end of Q1, early Q2 next year. Okay. So uh, the, the investment continues. Yeah, absolutely. Exciting times. Yeah. Well, congratulations, Thank Mark. You. I'm sure it's going to be certainly an interesting six months following that. Yeah, I hope so. Following that accreditation. Yeah. And hopefully maybe in the spring at SMT or one of those shows we'll be able to catch up with you and update. Yeah, great. Thanks Brilliant. for your time. Thanks, Phil. Thank you. Cheers.